Hello everyone, in front of the Fire Lord here, and where is back? And so am I. Sorry for being gone. I can see you're no stranger to the finer things. So today he's brought the Veracres and for this warf and like a rapid waxing moon. Wait, it's a, oh, it's a new weapon. What? I don't have enough. Okay, I'm gonna have to sell stuff for it. Good to know, but Nothing I'll worry about that later. Anyway, he also has Prime Smite Infested, 55% damage to Infested on melee, Thermite Round, 60% Heat and 60% Stas Chance on Rifles, Prime Charge Shell, 165% Electricity on Shotguns, Prime Chilling Grasp, 165% Cold on Shotguns, Full Contact, 120% Impact on Shotguns, the Prisma Gorgon, uh, a bad weapon, it's kind of nice, it's pretty. I wouldn't say it's the best, but it is pretty, pretty decent. Uh, definitely a hundred munitions weapon, though. The Prisma Gracata as well is a very nice, pretty weapon and great if you want to just shoot as many bullets as you can. Definitely low on the damage, as you can tell. The Katir Presence, if you want to just stand like Katir and judge everyone from a distance. The Zephyr Immortal Skin, which is bad, Prime is 100% superior. The Redeemer Alexis Skin, which is nice redeemer skin they have the doma sandana kind of interesting not what i prefer but it's not bad sandana apparently i purchased it the orkin tower extraction scene it's a really nice scene i really suggest getting it i do not have it but i'll buy it another time because i want to get other stuff here instead the katira atmos diadem the complete spoiler thing for spoiler unicorn thing for your operator the kavat sentinel mask Kind of cool, actually. I like it. I don't think I'd ever do it because I don't use any of Sentinel for the most part, but it's pretty cool. The Gavat Sentinel tail attachment, so you can add the Gavat tail to your Sentinel. The Gavat Sentinel wings as well, because none of the Gavats have wings, but hey. The Katir stencil, if you want to customize your special ship with Vera Katir's unique symbols. The Tiburon Alexa skin. I have to say it looks really nice on the base coloring. I don't know how it looked in game, but not bad there. The Deimos Vel Velocipod Rex. This is pretty much something you can just put in your ship. It looks pretty cool. I think I just riding one of them. That's awesome. The Tanukai shoulder plates. Yeah, they kind of look look a little interesting. The Tanukai chest plate. Actually. Kind of flatter than the others. I like that. And the Tunukai leg plates. Pretty fancy. A little I want, but it's bad. The Fade Path Ephemera, which is a lovely and very pretty Ephemera that leaves some worsty feels to you. And last but not least, the Sands of Anaros Blueprint for Anaros. This is how you get base Anaros unless you buy him from the market for Platinum. Thank you so much for watching, I'll everyone. And I see you all next time. Bye, everyone. Take care. Peace.